good morning you guys welcome to or welcome back to my channel it is currently sunday june the 2nd it has been way too long since i filmed a youtube video but today's the day and i thought that i could just like kind of take you through my weekend i know i'm starting this on a sunday but at least take you through a couple days of my week i wanted to give you a couple life updates one is i chopped my hair off like a month ago. I don't know if you can really tell since it's in a ponytail. It took a little bit of getting used to for sure, but the whole experience around getting my hair done was just kind of traumatic to say the least. Um, I went and got my hair done and 20 minutes after I left the salon, I was in a car wreck. Totaled my car. Um, luckily it was not my fault. I won't go into all the details, but I did lose my car. So I chopped my hair off, I lost a car, and here we are. I also realized that I've never really given a introduction on my channel before. So I kind of wanted to just give you like a little bit about what I do, what my life is like apart from YouTube. I'm 21 years old, I'm a Christian, and I'm in full-time music ministry with my family. We have been doing that for 13 years now, so basically my entire life. It's my mom and my dad, my two older brothers who are twins and myself that all sing and play instruments and yeah we travel on a bus singing in churches and at events and I basically live on the road so I am not home that much probably like two to three days per week and so that keeps me very busy but it is so fun and I love it and I'm so blessed to be able to do this. But yeah, that's kind of a little bit about my life. And then another life update, now that you kind of know a little bit about my life, we do record music and so we are in the middle of recording a Christmas album. Kind of weird to be recording Christmas music in June, but it's been so fun. And so for the next couple of days, I'm going to be in the studio working on that. And so I thought that I could take you guys along for that. Yeah. That's what I'm up to today. Also, I was just sitting here and I remembered something that happened the last time I was at this church. We sing at this church every single year. It's a sweet little country church. I know I'm gonna sound like a crazy person, but I promise you guys this happened. I don't think you can see it through here, but there is a graveyard right across the road from this church right here. When I tell you that there's like no houses around here, like this church is there is nothing around this church. <laughs> so it's just the church on this hill and then the graveyard, but that's literally it. And I was sitting in the car getting ready and I'm looking, I can see the graveyard through the car window. I'm sitting there doing my makeup and all of a sudden I'm like, mom, there's a little girl in the graveyard. I don't really know how to describe what she looked like, but she looked like she was out of a different time period. Like she had on like this cute little short fluffy dress tall socks a big bow in her hair and she was carrying a doll and she runs over to this grave and she just stands on top of this grave and is just looking at this grave and we just watch this little girl like we don't even know what to do we're just so confused at what we're looking at and then she just turns around and runs back up the hill i just <laughs> sometimes i still think about that and i'm like literally what what did i witness i'm i'm not even sure i will let you guys know if i see that little girl this morning because what in the world i just asked bailey to go over there and see what it said on the grave mm. it was a little girl born in the early 1900s late 1800s was, yeah there was four kids named jane i am so scared <laughs> Obviously much much later now. Um, I've got to do a better job about vlogging throughout the day. Sorry about that I'm gonna really try and do better tomorrow. But tomorrow is gonna be a very very busy day I have a long studio day ahead of me. I am gonna try my best to get a little extra rest tonight So I will see you in the morning Ooh, 
finished quite a bit later. I had to come outside because I didn't want to talk in there while they were recording, but I kind of just wanted to give you guys a little bit of a run through of what these days are typically like. Normally we start around 10 a.m. and typically we go to about 7 or 8 p.m. at night. I guess a lot of people just assume that you stand at a mic and sing through a song once or twice and then bam, you have a song, but that is just not the case. And it's not that you're not able to do that, but a lot of times you might just get one or two possibly three songs done in a day. That's just how it is. Especially on a recording, you just try extremely hard to make sure every single word is pronounced exactly the same together. Every breath is the same. And so it's just a lot of work. This is my eighth or ninth album. And every single time, the whole process of just creating new music is so fun and exciting. And yeah, I absolutely love it. Okay, I'm so sorry. Okay, wait, I gotcha. Okay, I got it now. One more time. Okay, sorry. Do it again, okay? I don't know if anybody else is this way. Literally, immediately when I get home from somewhere, I'm changing into comfy clothes. Like, within minutes within seconds putting my hair up like it's just too much i can't handle it what can i say i'm just a comfy girl much better now i'm gonna get in my bed and rot for the rest of the evening once it gets past 9 p.m sorry i have plans i don't make the rules some clothes and I really thought I was gonna love this. I feel like it's giving prison inmate instead of cute so. Hello vlog and I thought I'd give you a little haul of some of the stuff I got. So first up I went to Target and I actually bought these sunglasses that I'm wearing. I think they're so cute and these have 100% UV protection so love that. And then I also got, this is kind of random, but I have been looking for a belt like this for a while and I just thought that it could be really cute with the right outfit. Obviously, not this outfit. She's cute. And then I went to Home Goods. Obviously, Father's Day is coming up and my dad's birthday is right around the same time and so I picked this little mug up for him that says, I'm not sleeping, I'm just resting my eyes. That is the perfect dad mug. Dad, if you're watching this, I hope I didn't just ruin your birthday gift, but Home Goods had so many cute Father's Day cards. So if you're looking for a good place to find one, run to Home Goods. So it's been a couple of hours since I've filmed anything. We're getting ready to go play pickleball and maybe have a little picnic and I'm really excited. <laughs> 